Making sure you have the proper litter box for your ragdoll is important for your ragdoll's health and litter box habits. Some cats are particular about their elimination options. A ragdoll cat is no different. Accommodating this breed's large size when it comes to litter boxes can be tricky. If the litter box isn't comfortable enough for them, they could refuse to use it. Different shapes and styles can also affect your ragdoll's desire to use their litter box. The proper litter box for your ragdoll will depend on their specific needs and comfort level. Ragdolls can weigh up to 18 pounds and be 16 inches tall. With the size of the ragdoll breed in mind, we chose the best litter boxes for this breed. Keep reading for our reviews of these top picks to familiarize yourself with the options and make the best choice for your cat. Our pick for the best overall litter box for a ragdoll cat is the Van Ness Giant High Sides Cat Litter Pan. The size and affordable price make this an ideal choice for large cat breeds. The high back on this box will help trap any kicked or pushed litter. If your ragdoll tends to pee high, the back of the box is designed to contain this and collect any urine spray before it reaches your floor or walls. The box is also made from BPA-free plastic and can be recycled when it's time to get a new one. This durable box has been reported to give large cats enough comfortable room to do their business and keep litter from scattering everywhere. The slope in the back of the box might make it difficult to clean. There are also reports of the plastic cracking after a full cleaning and litter change. Our best pick for the money is the Arm & Hammer Rimmed Wave Cat Litter Pan. This litter box is less expensive than others but will still get the job done. The rim around the box offers the cat privacy while also collecting any litter or urine spillover. The rim is removable for easy cleaning with just soap and water. The surface area inside the box is large enough to accommodate a ragdoll's size. This box would be best for a cat that does not prefer a covered box but would benefit from having one. If your ragdoll is a digger, some litter may still spill out of the front entrance of this box, which is lower than the sides. Some litter has also been reported to spill out of the opening where the rim meets the top of the box. This rim may warp over time and not lie flush to the box. Our premium choice is the Buddha Dome Clean Step Litter Box, which is covered but still large enough for a ragdoll to use. The igloo design gives your ragdoll privacy and does a decent job containing litter box odors. It's also ideal if you have a dog that is interested in nosing through litter boxes. The design makes it difficult for a dog to get inside of it. The stair ramp catches any litter spillage as the cat exits the box. It also helps senior cats by giving them a ramp to walk on instead of having to jump over one side to enter and exit the box. But the two parts of the dome, the lid and the base, don't lock together, and they can get bumped and become misaligned. The ramp is also not detachable and has been reported to be hard to clean. The large base of the Petmate litter pan provides roomy stability for large cats and kittens. The box design prevents spills and litter scatter if your ragdoll is particularly messy, as kittens usually are when they're learning to use a litter box. Kittens as young as 8 weeks old have been reported to use this litter box easily. There is no shorter side to use as the entrance of this box. Cats just have to jump into it. Larger ragdoll kittens can comfortably use this box. There are reports of the inner corners of the box being difficult to scoop out. But once emptied, this litter box is easy to clean with soap and water. Made with large cats in mind, the Petmate Top Entry Litter Cat Litter Box can easily catch high-streaming urine or scattered litter. The opening is on top so the cat has to jump onto the box and then in through the opening to use it. A large cat can have peace and privacy when using the litter box due to this design, and the lid lifts off easily so you can scoop used litter clumps. This design keeps interested dogs out of the litter box. The top of the box is made of textured material, enabling your ragdoll to get their grip as they jump out. The box is also sturdy enough to accommodate the size and weight of a ragdoll. However, senior cats may have trouble jumping on top of the box to find the opening.
This Amazon Basics No Mess hooded cat litter box is designed to fit into the corner of a room for a large cat to use this box comfortably. It contains a sifter tray so the contents of the box can be strained all at once. This can create a bit of a mess, so we'd recommend continuing to scoop if this process is too much work. The size of the box and its ability to fit into the corner are the selling points. A rag doll can easily fit in this box, and it doesn't take up too much space in your home. If you want to use the sifter, be sure to use a litter that clumps, as others won't sift nearly as easily. If you're using pine litter, the sifter won't work as well. The Nature's Miracle Silver Oval Hooded Litter Box is a covered box. So if your cat friend doesn't mind being enclosed or likes privacy, this box could be the option for you. There are built-in odor neutralizers in the material, and it comes with a charcoal filter to absorb smells. The top and bottom latch together with snaps and come apart, but the best feature is the flip top. Instead of having to unsnap the latches every time that you want to scoop, just flip open the top flap to give yourself access to the inside of the box. You can save the snapping of the latches for when you're doing a complete litter change and box cleaning. The interior of the box also has a non-stick coating, making scooping even easier. This spacious box will accommodate large cats, including rag dolls. There are reports of the latches not being secure. If you have a high-spraying cat, some urine may leak out of the back of the box between the lid and the base. The non-stick coating on the Nature's Miracle Just for Cats Advanced High-Sided Litter Box makes cleaning easy and prevents buildup. It also has an antimicrobial coating so no bacteria will grow inside the box. The high walls offer your rag doll a private place while capturing any loose litter or urine spray. Taller cats can benefit from the open design without a lid. There are reports of litter being kicked out of the low entrance to the box. Also, the entrance is so low that some cats eliminate outside the box while standing inside it. While the box is large, there are reports of it being too small for big cats. Purchasing a litter box is an important decision. Some cats are particular about their litter boxes, and if you have a multi-cat household, each cat may have a different preference. Large cats like ragdolls can have an even harder time choosing a box because they need something bigger than average. Awkward shapes and uncomfortable entrances and dimensions can make for an unhappy kitty. If you notice that your ragdoll is eliminating outside of the box and you've ruled out any medical issues for this behavior, with your veterinarian, the reason may simply be that your ragdoll wants a different box. Here are a few things to keep in mind when choosing a litter box for your ragdoll. Some large felines can cram themselves into a smaller litter box and use it just fine. Others refuse to do that. If a cat is uncomfortable using a litter box, they will find ways to make themselves more comfortable. This can include going outside the box. A litter box that will accommodate your ragdoll's size and still have extra space is a good rule to follow when choosing one. Your ragdoll should be able to easily turn around in the box. If the litter box is covered, the lid shouldn't be so low that the cat has to crouch to do their business. The shape of the litter box also plays a role in how your ragdoll uses it. Some cats prefer corners while others like a round shape. With corners, sometimes cats choose their favorite one and you know to always scoop in that area first. If your ragdoll is a sprayer, high sides or covered boxes will help contain this mess. As frustrating as it may be to have to deal with this behavior, the right litter box can save you a great deal of hassle. The area of your home where you are going to place the box should also be considered. Will you have to put this box in a corner? Then a rectangular box or corner-shaped box would work best. Will the box be out in the open for people to see? You can get a litter box that matches your home decor. The only thing that matters, though, is if your ragdoll uses it comfortably. The color and shape can be your choice as long as your ragdoll is happy. Some cats prefer a covered box because it offers privacy. Cats are vulnerable when they're using their litter box, and they want to be sure they'll be safe. Wild cats eliminate in private areas and don't leave themselves open to be targets of attack. 
This instinct remains in domesticated cats. If your rag doll likes a covered box, this can also go a long way toward preventing the odor in the box from spreading throughout your home. The cover contains the smell better. When your rag doll is using a covered box, their head should not touch the lid while they are doing their business. If this happens, you need a taller box. Uncovered boxes can work fine for cats but they don't contain litter scatter that well. If the sides are low, the cat can eliminate outside of the box without meaning to. If your rag doll needs higher sides, they are available. Rims are also available to put on top of an uncovered box to try to better contain the contents. If you've tried everything and think that the box that you chose is perfect but your rag doll is still unhappy, maybe it's not the box at all. There are different litter types on the market today, and getting one that your rag doll doesn't like can lead them to stop using the box altogether. If you've recently switched litters and noticed a change in your rag doll's behavior, try switching back. The best litter to choose is something unscented, absorbent, and dust-free. Cheaper litters have more dust and can cause breathing problems in cats if inhaled. Keep the litter box clean. If the box is too dirty, the cat may choose not to use it. Put the box in a place where your rag doll will have privacy but that isn't too far away from the regular activity in the home. A spare bedroom, office, or bathroom will work. Always make sure that your rag doll has access to the litter box and that the door to the room isn't accidentally closed. By scooping the box every day and regularly emptying and washing the box to refresh the litter completely, you'll have a happy kitty with no elimination issues.